My first guest is a talented actress who stars in the new movie Our Friend, which is in theaters and on demand this Friday. Here she is, Dakota Johnson. Hi, Dakota. Thank Hi. you so much for being on the show. Uh, Thanks for having me. You look great. I haven't seen you in a while, so we have a lot to catch up on. First things first, last March, you, you gave a tour to Architectural Digest, and the internet loved it. Uh, I loved it too. It was just people were fascinated with your with your green kitchen and uh, your love of limes. Uh, during the yeah. tour, you you very clearly state that you love limes. Take a look at this video. I love limes. <laughs> I love them. Yeah. Now, what 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 do you do with all of those limes? What do you I actually didn't even know that they were in there. I was giving the tour and went into the kitchen, and they it was set dressing. I'm actually, I'm allergic to limes. Oh my, stop it now. <laughs> yeah, I'm mildly allergic to them. Oh, and honeydew melon. So another green thing from the outside. You're good with the honeydew melon. Oh no, and that. the inside. You can't just, no one eats the outside of a honeydew melon. It's kind of beige and then the inside is green. Yes, correct, yes. I wouldn't eat the outside. It makes my tongue itch. But limes do the same thing? Um, kind of. Limes make my tongue itch, too, yeah. Really? So, yeah. <laughs> I, that's so bizarre. I mean, you had a lot of, so it was just set dressing and it looked pretty. And then you're like, yeah, I love limes. You're just, like, just talking, going with the flow. Yeah, because it was hard to just ignore them. That's so I just lied. Lying. Just lied. <laughs> I went the full opposite Unbelievable. direction. Unbelievable. Uh, uh, I'm glad you came clean, man. Uh, <laughs> I know that you've also been working on projects. Uh, your production company, Tea Time Pictures. I love that. How's it going? Tea Time is going really well. We are actually going to shoot our first movie that we're producing starting February 1st. And Tig Notaro, who <gasps> you love. I love and who I love. And Stephanie Allen, they are married, yep. are directing together. No way. Oh, I yeah. love them. What's it called? Um, we're in a very heated debate about the title at the moment, so it's, it has no title. <laughs> Lime Time or Honeydew? Honeydew is not bad. I would watch that movie. I'd see Honeydew. I'd see Honeydew. <laughs> it has nothing to do with the yeah, movie. Yeah, no, I had to read the script first. But I'm sure Tig will, she will, she will, she'll have a good title. Yeah, I'm, I'm excited. It's going to be fun and funny. And it's like really contained and short and in L.A. And it'll be, it'll be cool. Uh, and then we make these lists every month. Well, now we used to do it weekly of like top 10 lists of what's the best to watch. Because I, get, I don't know about you, but I get really overwhelmed with kind of content overload of like what, it, what am I supposed to watch on all of the platforms with all of the amazing shows? So There's too many good shows. And then uh, I also heard that you're into the music playlists. What do you make playlists for? Everything. I make them um, for like certain times of the year or certain moods or road trips or dinner parties yeah, or dinner movies. Parties. I do it a lot for characters and things. Like if you were and I to go on a road trip, what kind of music would you put on? for us. Well, what's the vibe in our car? Fun, hitting the road, you're driving. Um, because uh, I'm driving. I think so, yeah. Do okay. you want to be passenger seat? Well, are we like, is it like high energy? Does it have an arc? Does it go like we start out, maybe we do, maybe it starts with um, by your side by Sade, because I'm sitting next to you by your side in the car. I and then we're kind of grooving. And then maybe it gets really upbeat halfway I, through because we're bored and it's a road trip. I can and then see we us. get a fight. And then it goes to like Philip Glass. Yep, we get in a little tiff. Rolling Hills. We get in a tiff, <laughs> but then we have to go to the, like, the restroom, and, like we get a snack right up and get our blood sugar back up. And then we make up again. Yeah, when we, when we stop for a snack and you go to the restroom, then it's waiting on a friend and stones. <laughs> I, I was thinking at one point, do we sing Hit, hit the Road Jack like, and like really get into it and like fake lip sync and like laugh and stuff? Wait, yeah. now I'm driving. Oh yeah, well. Now, I, don't worry about it, I'll drive. That's what the fight was because you're a backseat driver, so then you take over because I don't like fighting. 
No, I don't like fighting, but you know, I'm not even a backseat driver, but it's either go with the GPS or don't go with the GPS. I can't, I can't be watching you going like, what? What do you mean make a right? I would never make a right. I go, yeah, then turn it off. Just go your way. Got it. But if we're like, hit the road, that, don't you come back no more, no, then you go like, that's right, hit the road. And it's like that. And we like, bait, we start oh, yeah, choreographing yeah. a thing to it. Maybe you have a, yeah. cur maybe you have a kerchief. Probably, yeah, because we're in a convertible. Now we're talking. Yeah. You, you know, we're definitely in a convertible. Where are we going? I think we're just touring like, like those weird things that you can see like on Route 66, like, world's biggest uh, ball of yarn, stuff like that. Okay, yeah. Just for like some Instagram uh, photos kind of to trip. post. Yeah, <laughs> all right, this yeah. sounds fun. I like starting with Sade, by the way, that's my jam. By yeah. your side, that's my one. Great song. Oh God, right now, it's just, it's a- I'll make you a playlist. You will? Yeah. I'd love one. Hey, I wanna tell you about your new movie. It's called okay. Our, Our Friend. Uh, yeah. It's based on a true story. For anyone who doesn't know it, can you, can you set it up? Yes, it's based on a true story of a, a couple who the, the wife, the woman, in, has terminal cancer and their best friend moves in and sort of takes care of them. And throughout this, this story, like tumbling over the years, um, it's about like immense friendship and pain and torture and, and like tragedy, but also humor and levity and love and, and m most of all, just compassion. You do a great job in the movie. We even, uh, we even get to hear you sing a little bit. I don't think I've, I don't think we've heard you sing before, right? How was that experience? No, that was um, so scary. I actually had, I have a little bit of stage fright, like, I, when I come on your show, I get really um, nervous and I laugh and then cry most of the time. <laughs> you cry, you've cried, yeah, you've cried a couple times, yes. I've cried a couple times, which that's fine. I'm used to it by now, but singing in front of people is actually so terrifying for me. And we had to shoot the scene where you don't even really see me. The camera's like in the back of the house. Like you can't even really tell what's going on. And I'm meant to be performing in like community theater. And they hit playback of my voice, my vocal recording and called action. And my, it was like, I had a panic attack that manifested in all the ways that, that it does, that it can. So like, I just took off running, oh. running, like around this theater, around backstage. I was running around and then just started laughing hysterically. And everyone on the crew was like, what, what is she doing? <laughs> like running around laughing and then just started, stopped moving and started crying. <laughs> yeah, just complete, just embarrassment or what you just forced, just, you spun yourself out? I just w like got, I don't know. For that it scene? took over, I got so scared. It was like extreme flight mode. Gosh, for the scene yeah. where the, were you doing something from a play, right? Was it Checkers or something? Yes. <laughs> that was you can... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you know that really famous musical Checkers? <laughs> yeah, of course. The famous musical Checkers. But I, that was, oh, come on. That was so fun. Uh, well, you're great in it. I want to show everyone a clip. Here is Dakota Johnson in Our Friend. Take a look. I like to be blonde. No, I, um... I want to have blue hair, <laughs> and I also want to go to New York one last time and see Les Mis, and um, Mardi Gras, I want to be a Grand Marshal, and um, I want to sing on stage with Katy Perry. Dakota Johnson, our friend, is in theaters and on demand this Friday. When we come back, Dakota is going to settle some of the biggest debates of all time. Stick around. And on and on and on, uh, I said, and it's on.